welcome back to the next Juno New Origins video. This contract is named Luna Rover. We will get a pre-built rover that we need to land on Luna. So we need to build the lander ourselves this time. Once the rover is on the surface, we need to drive it to three sample locations to fulfill the contract. Let's reuse our Luna Lander Mark 1 and simply try to replace the payload. We can only attach it at the top of the rover and the rover seems to come with its own interstage separator mechanic. So now that the rover is at the bottom, we need to find a different place for the thrusters. Let's try to put them to the sides of the rover. And fail number one. The additional weight of the rover led to us not having enough Delta V to actually land it safely on the lunar surface. Finally, we have a good approach and I'm pretty confident that we will make the landing. And we did it! Now let's detach the rover. Oh my god, it is unfolding some solar panels and stuff and I think we need to get the rocket out of the way first. Okay, 
That worked. So now let's switch controls to the rover and drive to the three locations. Holy moly. How is that rover control supposed to work? I have no idea. I'm pretty sure there's something wrong with it. But hey. It moves, we can steer somehow. Let's get to those three locations. And we did it. All three locations visited. We get a nice amount of money and 30 tech points on top. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.